Hi, I'm Dr. Dipali Bharadwaj and I'm here to discuss and deep bust stretch marks. Stretch marks are benign skin scars, they are benign skin lesions and they look very fine but uh, nobody wants them. Once they are white, it is extremely difficult to treat them. So let us understand how we prevent them. And first of all, why do they happen? They happen because of rupturing of the elastin and collagen, because of rapid weight gain and even because of rapid weight loss. It is seen in uh, gym goers. It is seen in people who use and abuse topical steroids. It is also seen in bodybuilders. Well, there are different kinds of stretch marks like uh, there is a stria distense, which is because of the stretching, atrophicans, because of very thin skin, there is stria rubre, which is the best. If it is stria rubre, which means it is red color and that is the time when you start treatments, then even topical treatments are enough. Then there is stria alba, which is white, stria cerule, which is blue. The blue one is comparatively rarer in the North India, but you see it still in the Eastern India and certain parts of India for sure and of course in the world. Well, medical treatments for stretch marks is cryotherapy, which works excellent for all kinds of stretch marks. It's slightly painful, but I believe it really works. Chemical peel does not work. Uh, microdermabrasion and derma rollers do not work. They're very temporary. They will work till you use them and you stop them and there is no result. Uh, well, topical creams, which is containing ceramides, moisturizing, hyaluronic acid and tretinoin works excellent in the initial stages, especially if it is stria rubre, which is the red color stretch marks. Of course, my lasers work as a dermatologist's office. You can go ahead for erbium laser with PRP, which has excellent results. Even CO2 laser has excellent results on stretch marks. It is just time taking, more expensive, slightly painful and the doctor has to really be good and know his art. Please prevent stretch marks. Yes, prevent them. Stay hydrated. If you know your skin has a tendency and you're going to become pregnant, then yes, uh, you know, that is the time you have to do all the measures to prevent stria gravidarum, which is a very common form and 80 to 90 percent of women during pregnancy develop stretch marks for life. Hydration has to be inside out. You need to have a supple skin. You need to have a diet rich in vitamin A, C, E and omegas. Omega you can get from all the dry fruits, nuts, all those things which contain minerals and omegas and fatty acids. Do some muscle building exercises, even if you're already on the weight loss or the weight gain form. Uh, try and moisturize inside out as we are repeating. Use always a glycerine rich soap. Yes, glycerine rich soap will ensure that the skin uh, is moisturized and the content of the skin oils stay consistent. Using certain oils topically, especially uh, for preventing the stria of pregnancy, jojoba oil is my favorite. In jojoba oil, you can even add a little bit of coconut oil, vitamin E capsule you can burst open and apply. Have a vitamin E rich diet, which will also help make the skin supple and, you know, thicken the elastin and collagen fibers, hence preventing them from breaking and the appearance of stretch marks. Well, gentle massages with these oils will definitely help on the area where you're developing the stretch marks. Besides this, of course, having lesser stress and stress from UV rays. If the area, especially for gym goers, if it's on the arms, if you don't wear sleeveless and go in the sun, it's going to help you. Otherwise, those stretch marks can become more permanent and leave scars. What we cannot fight besides all this is the genes, the genes and the genetic skin type and our tendency to have the stretch marks. So if you still have the stretch marks and these treatments have not worked or you don't want to do the laser, then the last option, of course, is inking it, tattooing it and masking the stretch marks, even a skin color to hide it or a design which you think you can live with for lifelong. But yes, maintain your skin health. Keep asking us questions and stay tuned with me exclusively on The Print.